Madam Vice President, Hi. good Hi, to Matt. see you. Good to see you. Thank Appreciate you. you. Tonight, Hi. Vice President Kamala Harris back in Washington after our exclusive. Two stops in La Crosse Monday, her third trip to Wisconsin this year alone. A key swing state as Congress tonight prepares to send President Biden a massive foreign aid bill for Israel and Ukraine, including a provision that could ban TikTok nationwide. I'm curious, are you comfortable being the administration that signs legislation into law that could potentially ban TikTok? Well, let me be clear. We do not want to ban TikTok, and that is not our intention at all. We're not trying to ban TikTok. We're basically saying we got to pay attention to who the owner of TikTok is and pay attention to what that presents in terms of national security issues. The foreign aid coming as tensions between Israel and Gaza intensifying, protests across the U.S., a rabbi at Columbia University urging Jewish students to return home for their safety as Passover tonight is just beginning. I'm curious broadly your concern of the level of anti-Semitism we're seeing across the country mm -hmm. this week and in recent days. I am very concerned about it. Frankly, over what we've now seen since October 7, um, we're seeing it only grow. And I'm concerned deeply about it. At the same time, we saw some 48,000 voters vote uninstructed here in the primary in, in Wisconsin, mm -hmm. a protest to the administration's support of Israel. How do you get those voters back ahead of November? Well, there are a lot of issues that are at play in November, and the stakes are very high. And I think when people get closer to November, they're, they're not going to agree with everything our administration has done. But when it comes to fundamental values around freedom, I think that's what people are going to care about. Wisconsin tonight, a must win ahead in November. Former President Donald Trump currently leading this part of the state in the polls by some 12 points. In La Crosse, I'm Matt Smith, WISN 12 News. And statewide, former President Trump leads President Biden by two points in the latest Marquette Law School poll. Much more of Matt Smith's exclusive interview Sunday morning on Upfront on 12.1.